Hello and welcome back to my channel. So if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel, OK Mama by Mag. So first of all, if you made it this far in 2020, congrats! Boy ka pa! Oh, diba? Very good. Kasi yun lang talaga yung objective natin this year, diba? Just to make it through 2020 and hope for the best na 2021 will be a better year for the rest of us. So, natatawa ko every time I browse through the mom groups and then nags nagtatanungan na sila parang, Uy, anong planner mo for 2021? And I'm like, wow, may planner na sila magka-planner? So, may planner na rin sila for 2021? Buti pa sila. Parang ako, gusto ko lang yata mabuhay through 2020 and then bahala na in 2021. <laughs> so, if you haven't checked it out, there is such a thing called the Oppa Planner. Ayan Siguro, at first glance, hindi mo alam kung ano talaga siya. But yeah, it comes in a box. It looks like this. So there are two colors available. Merong pink and then merong blue. So I picked the blue one because wala lang. It's just easy on the eyes. At saka hindi siya masyadong girly. Ayaw ko sana masyadong girly na, na look ng planner. Um, and it comes with these cards here. It says, Anyong! Dahil daw sobrang excited nila na na misspell nila si Kim Soo Hyun. This is isang page nila, yun. So parang may apology letter pa dito. But it's okay kasi sulit naman siya. You'll be really happy once you get it. By the way, it comes with these stickers. Yay! May mga stickers na mga open natin. <laughs> Ang favorite ko dito ay si, si Cha Eun Woo. It's very cute. And Oppa of the Month ko siya kasi, ano, na-addict na ako sa True Beauty. Tapos ang tagal, tagal ng next episode. Oh well. My second favorite would be Park Yung Sik. So yeah, welcome back, Oppa. Tapos na yung military training niya. So yay! Anyway, ito yung shura niya. So it looks like this. And very simple lang siya. So from the outside, very discreet siya. Hindi, hindi siya sobrang obvious na Oppa planner siya, di ba? Ay, hindi lang siya basta-basta mabubuksan like a notebook. Yeah, it looks like a really nice planner. So, very cute with an artwork over there. But if you look closely, it says, Anyong! It has South Korea. It has the South Korean flag. And a lot of other Korean elements in there. But a very, very subtle lab. So, ano meron sa OPA planner? And what makes it so special? Siyempre. Well, iba kundi yung ating mga opa. Ayan, meron tayong spread. Tapos, add dyan yung mga favorite opa natin from Nam Juyuk, Song Joon Ki, to PSJ. Ayan, ang dami nilang lahat. Actually, kulang pa nga siya eh. Siguro dapat, ano, mag-comment kayo ng mga feeding nyo kulang dito sa opa planner. Uh, so far, ang hindi ko nakikita dito ay si Cha Eun Woo, si Jung Hae In, ay, na joke lang, andito siya. Ah, uh, sino mo wala dito? Ah, yung mga bago, yung sa startup. Si Kim Son Ho, wala siya dito. Nam Joo Yook is here. Yan. So yun, baka may naiisip pa kayo sino wala dito. Comment down below. Tsaka sana pakinggan tayo ni Oppa Planner para in 2022, mas madami na tayong laman. And then, meron tayong K-drama bucket list. Noong una, akala ko parang bucket list siya ng mga K-drama na papanoorin. But actually, these are things to do para mas ma-appreciate mo ang mga k-dramas. Like, attend a fan meet with the opa. Learn how to write hangul. Learn how to read hangul. Learn how to speak in Korean. Make a k-drama OST playlist. Eat Korean noodles while watching k-drama. Gusto ko itry ito. Kalista dito lahat ng birthdays ng mga opa natin. So, for January, it's Song Joon Ki. So, yan. So, meron kang um, parang parang big picture view ng January. And then, meron siyang parang dedicated pages for every day. So, meron kang weekly view. So, February, you have Kim Soo Hyun. Ayan, kulang siya ng O. Pero okay lang. I forgive you. Sobrang saya ko naman kasi nung nakbuka ko ito, diba? And then, we have Nam Joo Yook for March. And then, Sobrang gusto ko yung isang picture dito eh. Kasi gusto ko lang ipaalala na bago siya naging sad boy ng startup. 
Ito siya. Remember. Sa so weightlifting fairy, alam ko, lumabas yung abs niya. Pork bugum for me. Welcome back, Opa. Di Minho. For June. Di Dong Wook. Ayan. O, di ba? Fresh na fresh from Tales of the Nine Tailed. Yan. So, tignan natin last pages. Ano na? So, meron siya parang pocket here. Parang, it's common naman sa mga planners. Pero yung mga usually inipik-ipik mo, at least meron siyang pocket here sa likod. Pwede mo siyang lagay dyan. Mga let's learn Korean! Actually, maganda siya. As in, like, if you use it for work, and once kunyari, hindi na tayo work from home, di ba? So, makikita ka na nilang hawak-hawak yung planner mo. Hindi ka mapahiya. Because, you know, medyo discreet naman siya. Like, from the outside, you wouldn't know what it is. May ibang pages na kasama yung mga ibang opa. Like, this one, si Jisoo. Jisoo is here. Si Cha on me. Dito. And yung isang guy sa Goblin, Shocks. Ito siya. Yay! Hello! Yan. So, sobrang enjoy lang ako. Wala lang. I just wanted to share that there is such a thing called the Opa Planner. Ano pa na thing? In January 2021, mag-release pa sila ulit ng fresh batch ng Opa Planner. So, yay! At least meron na kayong preview kung ano yung laman. Um, binili siya ng husband ko for 699 pesos plus shipping fee. Yun. Sobrang sulit. So, yun. So, kung gusto mo ng mga simple joys in your life, get an OPA planner now. Ako, wala kong plano sa buhay. Pero dahil meron akong OPA planner, o, oh, ganada na ako magplano for 2021. So, sana kayo din. So, if you want to secure your own copy of the OPA planner, I'll put the links in the description below. And don't forget to please, please comment kung sinong OPA ang gusto nyo kasama sa OPA planner. And hopefully, sana makarating to dun sa mga gumagawa ng OPA planner para by 2022, yung mga OPA na gusto natin, andi na sa planners. So, yay! Thank you for watching. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share my videos. So, if you want to see my other videos, you can watch my other vlogs right here and right here. And don't forget to click subscribe and the notification bell for the freshest videos. Bye!